Hey, we are so pumped. We are bringing you all of your Gulls action here on Saturday night. One of the five games that we are airing here on the CW San Diego. We are kicking things off with a big celebration here. Not only do we have the man Gulliver, the mascot, the legend, but we also have president of business operations, Matt Savant here with us this morning. Guys, thanks so much for coming out. And uh, we are so excited, Matt, to do this partnership with you to offer San Diegans more ways to watch the Gulls. You know, Eric, this is a great partnership, and I want to say it's great to be here in person with you. As long as we stay about a hockey stick distance apart, I think I'll take this off so we can chat. Perfect. Uh, and that's what works so nice in yeah. hockey is that, uh, boy, a couple hockey sticks distance, right? And <laughs> yeah, you right. still keep those crisp passes. We've been seeing a lot of that lately uh, with the team. They're on a two-game win streak, uh, but we have a game tonight against the, against the Bakersfield Condors. What do the guys got to do to keep the wins going here? Yeah, so we've been playing really well, and we've seen that our uh, veterans have really been jumping up. And we got Sam Carrick, who's our team captain. He's uh, third in the league in goals with nine goals this season. Andrew potterowski has got uh, number one in the entire AHL in points. He's got 21 points. Those guys stepping up are really going to chip in. We can get a win tonight and hopefully tomorrow, too. Well, we have been doing very well at home. I mean, the home record's been incredible. But on the road, we've been a little shaky. So uh, what has the team been doing and saying to to try to pump them up when they're on the road. Yeah, as you mentioned, our home uh, our home streak was amazing to start the season. We started with six straight wins. That was a record, that right? That was a record in our franchise and ended up winning seven straight at home. So we're really hot at home. We're home tonight. We're home tomorrow on CW. Yep. Uh, but what we got to do is we got to keep coming together and putting pucks on net. We've got a lot of great talent on the ice. It's just got to come together, use our leadership to get those wins. You know who, besides Gulliver, really misses going to the games at Pachanga Arena? Me and thousands of others. San Diegans and Gulls fans. Um, with things starting to loosen up here, we're hearing about the Padres um, that are going to be opening up on April 1st. Of course, that's outdoor. You know, baseball is outdoor. When can we expect the Gulls to move from Irvine back to Pachanga Ice Arena and to have those fans in the stands again? Do we know? So, as you said, you love going to games. You miss going to games. The fans are the backbone of who we are at the San Diego Gulls. We love the fans and the fact that they been coming for years and years and years we can't wait to have them back so we are anxiously awaiting uh, our ability to host fans we're waiting on the state we're waiting on the county as we know we're in a global pandemic and the Padres are just allowed to uh, have fans come back in so we're waiting and as soon as the state and the county gives us the ability to have it we're going to do our best effort to get everybody back as soon as possible back to Pachanga, Pachanga Arena and rock that place. We saw Gulliver over here praying for that to happen and crossing all of his talons and all that's good, all that good stuff. By the way, um, we got to mention, you guys have some pretty cool stuff you brought here. This looks like a, a stick that all of the players have signed. Gulliver, did you bring a little gift basket for us? How nice, how sweet of him here. What do we got here? We got some goodies. We got the cowbell. We got some hats. We got some some swag. We got uh, some uh, bobbleheads and a jersey. And, and this, Matt, looks like it's a pretty special jersey. Well, we want to kick off the partnership with CBS CW. This is something that uh, we've been working on for a long time. We're yeah. really excited to be part of the family and we want to welcome you guys oh, in look properly. At that. So we've got your own custom made jersey <laughs> and this is really a way to say thank you for all the work that you guys have done to get us on the air. Our first game is tomorrow night. Uh, we're going to frame this up for you guys. We want you to hang it proudly awesome. in your we will. Uh, offices here. Uh, but this is this is a big deal for us and I think it's a big deal for you guys and this is another way for our fans to connect with this team and thank you to CBS and CW so very much. This is a big deal for us so thank you for that Matt. Yeah. Really appreciate it. This yeah. is a big deal for us and you you know, and for me personally, I've, uh, you and I have known each other for a couple years here, and um, we've talked a lot of puck, but we've also talked a lot about how we need more eyeballs on this great organization, and, and not just on the hockey games, but you guys do such great, incredible work in the community. These guys are hockey players on the ice, but they are outstanding community members off the ice. You guys contribute so much to our, our nonprofits in town. Talk about how important that is to the Gulls organization as we put up the schedule of the games that we're going to be airing here on, on uh, the CW. Well, uh, our community efforts are one of our pillars that we stand on. Right. We make sure that we're uh, working with local schools, local hospitals, and really local restaurants, especially during this time in the pandemic, we wanted to make sure that we were giving back to the local restaurants. So we had our fans donate money and we actually fed frontline workers with some of our partner restaurants. Those are just a couple of things that are really important to us to give back to San Diego. How important is it uh, for San Diego to keep supporting 
their team. I mean, we have the Chargers have left, right? This is, if, if you're not necessarily a baseball fan or you like the Potters and you need more swear, this is the big game in town. You yes, guys are the big game in town. You know, especially during the, uh, the winter months when uh, baseball is not necessarily in play, we are San Diego's team. Yeah. And uh, the fan base since 2015 has supported us through and through. We've led the entire American Hockey League in attendance twice during those times. So we know San Diego loves its hockey. We know there's a rich history here. And we're so thrilled that the fans can come back soon. We're not sure when, yeah. but hopefully soon. Well, we want people to be sharing their pictures with us on game night. And you can do that using the hashtag Gulls on CW. Gulliver, get your stick here. Let's see if me and Matt can try to put one past you. You're a pretty big guy, so i got to try to stick handle a little bit. we got to move around. Matt? Oh, no, we got to put it home. Yeah. <laughs> goal! Goal for the goals, and uh, it's a big goal for uh, for us, a big score for us, a big score for you guys as well, and uh, we're really looking to, uh, forward to joining the broadcast partnership. So thanks for coming out, guys, and we will see you on the CW here tomorrow night, 7 p.m. for the game.